Howdy ho, howdy ho! Welcome back. The first video of the year. So I like to start each year out with these wonderful, wonderful handouts. They show you how to draw animals step by step, shape by shape, line by line, okay? Um, so what we did last week, let's recap a little bit. Last week, we uh, put our names on our papers, of course. We always start out like that. And we started drawing um, shapes. Started drawing simple shapes. And we used these shapes as a, a precursor. We, we actually said, hey, if you can draw these shapes and these lines, you can pretty much draw anything else in the whole wide world. So we started off with those basic shapes, a square, circle, triangle, rectangle, and oval. And then we went on to a wavy line, zigzag line, curve line, and straight line, okay? We did all that in one day, and then we said, hey, once you get that done, you're going to choose one of these. Doesn't matter which one, you can choose whichever one you want. You practice on this side first. So I would say, hmm, let's see, the first shape here, we draw a circle, yeah, and then it looks like we add an oval to it, so let's do that. Add the oval, okay, and then the next step looks like we add uh, two more circles on either side, so let's do that. Circle here, circle there, okay, that works. Now let's flip it over, what's next? Uh, oh, okay, looks like we have our antenna, so let's add that there and there, okay. What's next? Oh, okay, got a smiley face, so let's put that boom, boom, and boom. Nice. Can you see that? That's kind of small. Yeah, I drew it really small, huh? All right, so let's go to the next one. Like it has a stinger. That's a triangle for the stinger. And then we have some, looks like curved lines in there. So let's add those curved lines in there, like so. Boom. Now, we have our bumblebee. Now, I want you to practice on the same side with your shapes, okay? Practice on that same side. Oh, I had an extra piece, huh, how about that? Practice on the same side with your shapes a couple of times. So if I chose the bumblebee, I would draw that a couple of more times on this side, same side with your name, same side with the shapes. Draw that, practice it a couple of times. And then when you flip over, this is when you draw it humongous, okay? This, yeah, small, like, Teensy weensy small, yeah. But this one, I want it to be humongous. Feel the whole entire paper. Like, like, okay, let's do it. Circle. Oh, that's a huge circle, Mr. P. Yes, it is. Yes, it is. Oval. Whoa, Mr. P, that's huge. Yes, it is. Uh, yes, it is. <laughs> let's go ahead and put the circles. Oh, my goodness, a circle came off the page. And let's bring it back. Yeah, it came off the page. Is that a no-no? Oh, no, it came off the page. That's fine. You can do that. Yeah. All right, let's go to the next one. I think it was a circle over here. Done that. And let's see, what else? What else was next? Let's see, after that. Oh, go to the next side. Oh, antenna. Let's do the antenna. So I'm going to go boom, antenna, boom, antenna. And then we had a smiley face to put on. So let's do that. Very easy stuff. Had a little stinger. Oh, wow. That stinger might just go. Let me see if I can fit it on the page. Boom and boom. Yes. It fits, and then we have lots of curve lines. So let's put in those curve lines on our page. And we are done. Yes, Bumblebee completed. <laughs> as far as the colors go, you get to pick whatever you want to use. You can color whatever color you would like to color. But first, I do want you to trace over your pencil marks. You grab yourself a color, eh, probably a dark color would be best um, to try to trace over your pencil marks. Get yourself a dark color here. And that's what I'm gonna do, just give me a minute. I'm gonna trace 
over everything that I did in pencil. And I'm gonna make a nice dark line here too. Nice dark line. Trace over the whole thing with crayon. So let me do that and then I'll come back when I am completely done tracing. Done! <laughs> All right, but once you do that, go ahead and start coloring in the different spaces, man. I have a bumblebee. I guess I can put some yellow in there, huh? This is uh, called orange yellow. Maybe I can use that. And see, you can turn over on the back, see if you like the color. Let's try it. Ooh, I like that color. That's gonna be a great color. So I'm gonna go back and color in some of my little bumblebee sections here. I'm gonna color it in this orange yellow color. I think that's gonna be really neat. I would like you to make sure you put a lot of color down. Put a lot of color down, guys. Cause the next step is gonna be super cool, but it's gonna to need to have a lot of color on our picture so don't like you know scribble it and then be done like really super fast actually spend some time we're going to spend the whole day coloring our sheet of paper here trying to get it just right after that we're done for the day so this is what we're doing today and i would like you now to go and have fun Okay, good, good. Nice snake. I think you have pencil there instead of crayon. Guys, don't color with pencil, because here's the deal. Wax won't work if you don't use wax. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Wax don't work unless you use I wax. love your kitty, and I love how you have things around your kitty that he would like to eat and play with. Well, how actually, wonderful. this is a machine project. I'm okay. gonna do a one at home, but it's gonna have to be the series two, which is the Christmas one. Oh, This nice. is the snack time series. Gotcha. Say that again for the camera. It's what? This, this is the snack time series one. Snack time series. And then you're going to have another one that's going to be Christmas themed? Yep. Okay. And then are you thinking of any more maybe? No, I'm doing it by the series. Doing it by the series. Is it, is it a holiday type theme or just kind of what comes to your head? No, it's actually just a, it's actually a collectible toy. They're really fun to collect. Collectible toys. But Paul and Shannon, which are YouTubers, okay. they taught me about well about Pusheen stuff. It was gotcha. it was very fun watching them open it. But my dad won't let me order any online, so I'm thinking about doing it when I grow up. Gotcha. And until then, you're going to actually do your drawings in the style of what those other YouTubers were doing. I like it. I like it. Lovely, lovely.